Jamie at Polar Lights and I have received several emails asking how to fold the TOS Enterprise photo etch on the warp engine grills. This is far easier to show than describe, so here goes. The etch parts fit onto kit parts numbers 45 and 46. Cut out the etch parts and file off the extra tab as I detail in many of my other videos. Now this is very delicate photo etch with all the holes and it being very thin. So you want to use a pair of flat pliers like those available from Xuron, and I really suggest using a uh, nice diamond file like the ones you can get from Tamiya, Tamiya, or Harbor Freight. Now temporarily attach the photo etch to the kit parts using some thin tape. Notice that the part is longer than the kit part, so there'll be some overlap. For the smaller piece, piece 45, the overlap will occur on both ends. For the longer piece, part 46, the overlap should only be on the angled end, as shown. Take a straight edge or other hard metal piece and fold the edges over so that they meet the angled ends. That's really all there is to it. Now you can remove the tape, remove the part, and glue it back in place with super glue, or if you're going to be lighting, I would suggest micro metal foil adhesive that dries clear and it really sticks well.